Hey guys, in this video, we are going to talk about centroid and what is a centroid, what exactly uh, we can do with the centroid, okay? When we were uh, children, do you remember what we used to do with a triangular flavor, you know? What do we need to do? We used to cut that flavor, we used to rotate that with a specified point, right? Where was that point? If I draw it in a midpoint of here and midpoint of here, it was somewhere here, right? Isn't it so? So when we were uh, children, we used to play a uh, rotational game and we never know what this point was, right? This point is called centroid. Okay? Centroid is what? Centroid is basically a point. Okay? In this case, this point help us to balance and also help us to rotate an object. So, if I take a triangle, if I take a triangle, if I want to rotate this, if I want to rotate this, we have to go somewhere around here. That is centroid. So, how to find this point? See here, it is very simple. What we need to do? First, we need to consider A, B, C vertices of a triangle. What we need to consider? We need to consider A, B, C of a triangle. These are vertices. Now, what we need to do? Again, if we know this length is 10, if we know this length is 10, I can find the midpoint of this, right? I can find midpoint of this base. How to do that? This is 5, this is 5. If this is 5, this is 5. I can find midpoint of this, right? Then what I need to do? I need to join this midpoint and the opposite vertex. Okay, this is called median. This is called what? Median. In the same way, here also I can find the midpoint of these two and again join this. In the same way, here also I can find the midpoint of these two points. Here, somewhere here, I can join these things. Now, the point of intersection of these three medians, the point of intersection of these three medium, median number one, median number two, and median number 3, that is this, right? This is called centroid, okay? Now, let's learn the formula for centroid, okay? This point, a point means it should have x, y, and z. It should have x, y, and z coordinates, right? To find x, what we need to do? To find x, we need to add x1 plus x2 plus x3 divided by 3. To find y ordinate, we have to add all the components of y, that is y1 plus y2 plus y3 divided by 3. To get z, we have to add all the z components, that is z1 plus z2 plus z3 divided by 3. Now, what is this x1, x2, x3? What is y1, y2, y3? What is z1, z2, z3? That is very simple. See, these are three vertices, right? So, this will have x, y, z. So, I can call this as x1, y1, and z1. This is also have three ordinates. That is x1, y1, sorry, x2, y2, and z2. This will again have ordinate x3, y3, and z3. Is that simple? Let's go in Canada once. So, in Madhavagaya, the first thing you can do is centroid hang find out Madhavagaya in the video. So, centroid is the point. What is the point? 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 Imagination is the point. Suppose, now, Chikori is the point. Play out on Thirksak try. So, Thirksak is the point. We have to find a particular point. What is the particular point? What is the point? What is the point? What is the point? What is the point? So, what is the point? What is the point? Imagine maru. So, this point to triangularly hang find out maru beku andra. First end maru beku, yadar wad length it kono, adar midpoint find out maru beku. A midpoint in the, one end maru tira, melgad tagadar idhi ke nanth, ee line ee ke nanth tira, median nanth tira. Adhe tira, more median yel intersect agatha, illa yel join agatha, a point ke center adan thay tira, adha definition. Okay na, but adha kya, sukta adha formula idha, formula na, kalth ko beku na, adha very important. Yaka da formula nipit kondra, questions maru tumba easy agatha. So, formula is x and y and z. x, y, z and the centroid. That's the point. So, x is going to be x1 plus x2 plus x3 divided by 3. x1, x2, x3 is going to be x1, x2, x3. So, this is 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 x1, x2, x3. This is x1, x2, x3. So, 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 this अरे तेरा z हैंग पाइंट आउट मार बैगो इधर लगे रहा z इधर लगे रहा z इधर रहा और मूर्ण ऐड मारी डिवाइड बाय थ्री अब टोटल अमाउंट रहेंगे इन बर्थ है मूर मूर ऑर्डिनेट्स पर रहता है डेट इज़ लाइक थ्री कॉमा फोर कॉमा फाइव दिस इज़ सेंट्रल ऑफ़ आ ट्रायंगल 
Okay, in the next part of the video, we'll solve one of your examination question because uh, this this uh, centroid questions has appeared previously in your examination. Okay. Okay, this is one of the examination question. Let's attempt it. So, what is given? See these three uh, vertices are given. We have to find centroid of these three vertices of a triangle. So, how to how to find it? We have to know the formula. So, x is what? x1 plus x2 plus x3 divided by 3. In the same way, if you want to find the value of y, how is that? y1 plus y2 plus y3 divided by 3. And also for z, how to find z? z will be z1 plus z2 plus z3 divided by 3. Why I have taken z? See here, in, in last examples, we saw only two coordinates, that x and y, but there is another coordinate given, that is here, right? So, x, y and z, we have to consider all these three. So, let's substitute it. So, how to find x? This plus this plus this divided by 3. So, minus 2 plus minus 1 plus minus 6 divided by 3. And how to find the y value? This plus this plus this divided by 3, that is 3 plus 4 plus 5 divided by 3. How to find the z value? How to find the z value? This plus this plus this, that is 1 plus 2 plus 2 divided by 3. So, we get x value as minus 2 minus 1, that is how much? Minus 3 minus 9, right? Minus 9 divided by 3. And to find the y value, how much is that? 5 plus 4, 9. 9 plus 3 is 12. 12 by 3, is that correct? Yes or no? So, minus 6, minus 7, minus 9, minus 9 by 3, 12 by 3 and to find z value, 1 plus 2 plus 2, how much is that? 1 plus, 1 plus 2 plus 2, that is 1 plus 2 plus 2, how much? 5 by 3. So, if I solve this, I'll get x value as minus 3, y value as 4, z value as 5 by 3. Just cancel, na? 3 1s are, 3 3 are. So, minus 3, 3 1s are, 3 4 are, minus 3, 4 and 5 by 3. Is that comfortable? So, if three vertices are given, if three vertices are given, you know how to find the centroid point. How to find it? Centroid point for x, y and if there is third ordinate is given, we have to take z, find the x1 plus x2 plus x3 divided by 3, y1 plus y2 plus y3 divided by 3, in the place z, z1 plus z2 plus z3 divided by 3. Find by substituting the formula, right? This formula, if you can just let's see the formula, x, x, x component divided by 3, y, 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 y component divided by 3, z, z, z component divided by 3. So, we'll get the x value, y value and z value. Is that simple? Is that very simple? Yes.